Chronic Pain Australia is a not-for-profit organisation. We were incorporated in 2006. We rely very much on the um, generosity of um, others who think we're doing something that's worthwhile. It's really challenging being a not-for-profit organisation, especially in the chronic pain space, because chronic pain is such a highly stigmatised phenomenon. The experience of chronic pain is not recognised by um, state or federal government as a condition in its own right. Uh, we all know that chronic pain is such a common problem. The Access Economics report of 2007 put the number at $34 billion per year. <laughs> One in three Australians is experiencing chronic pain. Maybe one in six is disabled by chronic pain. But, you know, just being a, an organisation that's standing up for consumers, that's advocating for consumers, is really not a very sexy thing. <laughs> We went to the federal government uh, a couple of years back in Canberra, drove down and asked the government for some support and they said, we know what you're doing, we think you're doing a great job, sorry we don't have any money. We then went to the state government and said, um, hello, you know, we're, <laughs> we're doing a great job, do you, know, do you think you could support us? And they said, yes, we know you're doing a great job and we really think it's a great service to the community, but I'm so sorry, we don't have any money. I, I live in hope that um, at some point, some level of government will see the merit in what we're doing.